In the midst of it all, God hears us. Have you ever had a time in your life when it just seemed like one thing after another, after another, after another just kept coming at you in your life and you feel like you're just in shambles around you? Hey, I'm Tim. I'm a parent. I have six kids. I want to encourage you in how to best answer life's questions for your kids, for yourself as you raise kids. And I look forward to our time together today. I've heard it said that you're either coming out of a crisis, going into a crisis, or in the midst of a crisis. This past month for me and my family was full. Uh, My sister-in-law got married, which was an exciting time. And then in June, our sickness came to our family and then we got well. And then my parents came from Oregon, which was a wonderful visit. They left and then we experienced a sudden loss in our family. It's been a lot. And in the midst of it all, God hears us. Psalms chapter five, verse one and through three has held comfort for us in the midst of trials this month. And this is what it reads. It says, listen, God, please pay attention. Can you make sense of these ramblings, my groans and cries? King God, I need your help. Every morning you'll hear me at it again. And every morning I lay the pieces of my life to your altar and watch for fire to descend. That picture of laying down yourself before the heavenly father and waiting for him to intervene just really captured where I am. So no matter what you're embarking on, you're going through or or you're coming out of God still hears you. I was challenged recently to to stop and think of all the blessings that I have in my life. And so as I sat and and just thought about all the good things, all the God things, all the blessings that God gives to me, they the number just continued to grow. I had a lot to be thankful for. So I wanna challenge you today. When you feel like the world is crashing down around you, I want you to remember this. God hears you. God hears your prayers, cries, and groans.